Hey everybody, this video is going to be an introduction to type 2 statistical error. We just did a video on type 1, this is its follow-up system. Um, type 2 error is very important for boards. Uh, there are a couple of tricks to, to realize uh, about it, but kind of the, <clears throat> the big gist about type 2 error, especially when you've been watching the rest of our videos, is that this is a false negative error. So type 2 error is a fancy way to say you had a false negative. Now, what the heck is a false negative if you haven't seen other videos? It means that you had a negative test or a negative study. It means that, you know, your study, you did this huge study, and it turns out there's no correlation between whatever, uh, obesity and diabetes or whatever, ha whatever happened. You know, this is a negative result. However, later on, a different study or a different test showed that this is actually wrong, that it should actually be positive. So um, a false negative means you had a negative test result, like your urine pregnancy test said you're not pregnant, when in reality, you were. Now that is a false negative or a type two error. A lot of times you use the beta symbol or B or Bravo, whatever you wanna to say, to denote the numerical value. So it'll be like Bravo equals whatever numerical result, whatever the probability is that you have a type two error. And the big thing here is, um, the way to remember this for boards, which is what you really care about, is there are two types of statistical errors they care about, type one and type two. We're talking about type 2 currently, and type 2 is B, and type 1 is A. So, number 1, alpha, number 2, beta. Um, so, that, those just go in order, just like the numbers and the letters do. And the mnemonic for remembering what type 2 error is, is B, you were blind to something. So, you came home, and you said, hey, you know, no worries, I'm not pregnant, when in reality, you were blind to the, to the fact that you were pregnant. So that's kind of the way to think of it. Now, the, the board prompt, just like we talked about in the other one, this is what you need to be prepared for, and you will see it, uh, either a type 1 or a type 2, will be something like, um, you did a study, uh, <clears throat> it, was, it was kind of poorly done, and they, at the end of the study, the researchers concluded that there was no link between um, cigarette smoking and lung cancer. However, in reality, you know that there is a link. This is an example of, and it'll be five choices, A, B, C, D, or E. One of those choices will probably be type 1 error, which we talk about in a different video. However, in this case, it'll be like choice C will be type 2 error. In this case, the researchers were blind to the connection between cigarette smoking and lung cancer. That is a uh, redundant, repetitive uh, introduction to the type 2 statistical error beta Blind, you dig.